How's it going guys, Sharblox here. So only a few minutes ago, I was over on the Roblox avatar shop and I was just browsing the emotes section. I don't know, I was just having a look at them. But little did I know guys, this would be the last ever time I would be able to have a tab open of the old Roblox avatar shop. Well, I say old, like the previous avatar shop update. Because yes, little did I know at the time, all of this has been changed. I'm so happy I kept this tab open so I can compare both updates. Let's go and take a look at the new version so we can see how much they differ. So refreshing the avatar shop, as you guys can see, it's clearly different. The recently updated sorter at the side here has gone. It now says all items, characters, clothing, accessories. Actually, this list is a lot smaller. Yeah, back to the old version quickly. Look, you could change it from all different stuff, even like collectibles and premium exclusives. Also, this tab right here is completely gone. Okay, that's a bit weird. They've still got buy Robux, of course. I'm pretty sure the search is still the same. They released this update not too long ago as well. I guess it's like a keyword selector or something. But now the tab on the left hand side is completely different. It's actually a lot more cluttered. This is weird. This kind of feels like this avatar shop should have been the previous update and they should have updated it to one that looks like this because look how simple this was. Less cluttered, less options. Now there's loads of random stuff on the left hand side and browsing is going to be a bit more complicated. So let's see. We don't have recommended anymore. We've got all items. We have got characters. We have got clothing. I guess this bit they've kind of like simplified quite a bit. We've got accessories so that includes everything. UGC and officially by Roblox. We've got avatar heads. I'll say faces are now under heads. Okay that's interesting and they're classic faces. So where are the normal faces then? I guess that's not out yet. We also have animations and yeah I guess they've kind of like categorized all of these things. So moving on to filters that is a lot different. Filters is suddenly very long. Oh, I see what they've done. They've taken the sorts tab, which used to be at the top. Yep, this one that used to be right here. And now they've kind of like merged it all together and stuck it on the left hand side. Unavoidable items. I'm happy that still works. Hang on a second. Let me just try like the browsing feature I normally use. So I normally go to all featured items. Hang on. Wait, so that would be recently updated, show unavailable. Then we would go to Roblox. Wait, hang on. Where would it? Oh, I literally have to type it in now. Wait, hang on. So I literally have to type in Roblox then click go then is it going to give me the results oh okay so that's how you do it now make sure it's an all items type in roblox show unavailable recently updated it's basically the same they've just kind of like annoyingly switched everything around to be fair in a couple of weeks time we won't even be complaining about this just at this point in time we're not used to it so we're just a bit like oh that's kind of frustrating but yeah the new avatar shop update not really anything exciting in typical roblox fashion they haven't really done anything new they've sort of like shifted everything around and just called it a day. The only thing that's actually new, I don't think I covered this yet, the keyword searcher. So you could click on vampire, then it would load up the vampire stuff. I kind of like that. The only problem is like, does anyone actually want to search for this stuff? I don't know, maybe zombie might be quite cool. Surely you'd just like think of it and just search zombie. You wouldn't see the keywords and suddenly think of it, but I don't know. Anyway, guys, that was not the only Roblox avatar shop updates because as well as the website, the Roblox app and also the universal app on your PC, got avatar shop updates as well. Yeah, check out this from Bloxy News. They've posted a video and everything. They said Roblox is beginning to roll out the new avatar shop cart feature to the universal app. The shopping cart allows you to try on different items at the same time and to then purchase them all at once. I swear we've got this on the Robro extension already, but that's kind of cool. It's a shame they didn't add this to like the actual website. It seems they don't really care about the website so much. They only care about like the iOS and Android app and like the universal desktop beta. Anyway, I guess we can try this. Why not? I really don't like using the desktop beta, but for the sake of this video, let's just go and open it up. Let's go and open the app. And it didn't work. That is absolutely brilliant. What is that dodgy website? Wait, hang on. I can't show that. It's showing my IP address. Oh God, let me try and reinstall it. Oh, I fixed it. It turns out I had to do it twice. Now it's updating. Hopefully it's now okay. It finally loaded, but oh my God, is this thing slow. I honestly don't understand how people people use this. It's such a mess. Anyway, where is the avatar shop? It's shop right here, isn't it? So if you click on shop, let's see. So I should be able to, is it? Oh, that's how it works. All you do guys is you just like select multiple stuff. So I'm literally turning my character into bootleg shark blocks at the moment. All right. So let's try on some random things. Go on then. That's okay. So let's click on try ons. Wait, I already own most of this stuff, right? Is there any way I can like scroll down this list? No. Wait, so the only thing I can buy is the, um, 
eyes because I don't own that yet. What are glasses? Not eyes. What am I talking about? Okay, let's try that again. Devil horns. Do I own that? I don't think I do. Oh, I don't know. What am I doing? Let's just try some random stuff. Some hair. There you go. A hoodie. Some other shades. There you go. That's perfect. Let's try it with this. I probably own some of them, but who cares? 130 Robux. So if we go and purchase this, where item after purchase? Yeah, we can try that. If we go and buy outfits. Okay, that's interesting. Two items purchased. So I'm guessing they updated my avatar as well. Did they? Can I go back? No, is it broken? Oh, it's working. Okay, so fair enough. That's kind of cool. Not the best feature ever, but I can see how it works. To be fair, maybe on mobile where the avatar editor is not so good, this might be kind of useful. And yes, it did automatically update on the Roblox website as well. So yeah, that's pretty interesting. So there we have it, guys. Two avatar shop updates. And yeah, I guess that's basically it. If you enjoyed this video, as always, make sure to leave a like and subscribe. Cheers for watching. I will see you guys in the next one.